Government at all levels have been called upon to make people with disabilities feel a sense of belonging. At a project presentation ceremony on the theme, creation of alternatives to irregular migration and human trafficking uh, event held in Benin City, those present said they have become concerned about their flight, their plights rather, and called for interventions. I want to recommend that both to the government and to NGOs that are in charge of empowerment to see persons with disabilities as the number one recipients. Number one recipient of empowerment. So whenever you don't include persons with disabilities in the villages, in the communities, we don't think of doing anything. Do encourage them, teach them, and give them what to use to work. And I tell you, they will turn it over. We have been neglected because we find it hard to get employment, even after managing to, to pass through the four walls of education. I find in so many ways that people who live with disability are being trafficked for begging and so many other activities. Now some stakeholders at the event also shared their views. So if ministries, MDAs now can come with a, a package of engaging them, we're good for them. You know, because anybody can be a victim. In fact, the vulnerable persons, the people with disability are even more vulnerable. You know, after the training, we're going to form them into cooperatives of 15. So we must have two cooperatives of persons with disability. Where else can you get that? So from the beginning, throughout, they are involved. We must recognize the fact that uh, the situation they find themselves Religion, God Almighty recognizes them that we should continue to, to carry them along in the scheme of things.